Hey everybody, welcome to eTrailer.com. I'm Bobby. Today we're taking a look at the Amp Lock Coupler Lock for rolled lip 2 inch or 2 by 16 inch ball couplers. So this can be a great way to go ahead and secure your ball coupler and prevent anyone from hooking up to your trailer and taking it away of course. So Amp Lock is known for the quality of locks and their materials and the TLS TSL2 is no exception. The material itself feels and looks well built and it's very tamper resistant. It's going to be standing up to picking, cutting, freezing, even having a little bit of shock absorption. So if somebody takes a sledgehammer to this thing, it's not going to be breaking anytime soon. It is going to be holding up quite well for ourselves. The heavy ductile cast iron ensures it will be extremely durable and reliable. It even absorbs shock as we mentioned. Now that electronic coating of the paint creates a corrosion resistant surface, which this guy's going to be out in the weather for a long time. So nice that it's not going to be just rusting away there on the front of our coupler. It can be staying looking nice and pretty for the seasons to come. Now the molded fit and the swivel design are going to make it hard to get a good purchase on the lock. Of course that molded fit is just these edges here. You can see not a lot of good contact points. It's kind of a rounded edge. So nothing's going to be really holding on to here. And as well, it just fits really nice into those rolled lip couplers. So you're not going to have a lot of great purchase points to get a pry bar into, especially this underside kind of covers it. So really just not a good access point unless you're taking off the appropriate way. And talking about that, the actual locking system for the amp lock is very nice as well. Our inner cylinder has a series of rotating discs that can be only be utilized by our included keys. Now the position of the cylinder is also part of its purposeful design. You can see this is how it would be sitting right Right there on our couplers of course and our cylinder is right here in the bottom so not going to be a lot of room to work with unless you know or underneath there you're going to have to on your back so somebody trying to access it isn't going to have an easy time trying to manipulate this lock because of where it's at so it does come with a couple of keys as well so if you're a little forgetful like me you're going to have a spare to make sure you can always take this off your coupler at any point which is going to be great now the lock pin diameter here is going to be seven eighths of an inch and that's what's actually holding this onto our coupler once we get it in place now talking about how how it actually works. I can go ahead and give you guys a little bit of a closer look here. So we can go ahead and see our guy right here. Now, of course, as we'll be inserting that onto our rolled lip coupler, just setting itself in place. However, that pins in our way right now, of course, right? But we can go ahead, take our included key here, start inserting it, finding that right position, and that'll pull that cylinder down. And one thing I like about it, yes, we can go ahead and leave our keys in there, or we don't even need those guys. All we need is in this position, and then I simply walk right up to my coupler, insert it just like so, and then I simply slide up that cylinder. So it's gonna stay nice and secure there. You can see not moving around. You're gonna need that key to get it out and it already is nice and secure there on our coupler. So really easy system to use and it's gonna do a great job. Nice that we don't have to have the keys there. Of course, make sure you do have them somewhere. You don't lock our coupler and all of a sudden you don't have a key, but you do have that option of just quickly going ahead and locking your trailer. Makes it really nice when you're trying to leave the job site or just get away for the weekend. And that way we're not having to worry about it too much. Talking about a little bit of dimensions here, we can go ahead and see exactly what we're working with. For the inside to the inside here, our max width is gonna be about four and seven eighths there to the very end. So right under five inches. So that should be decent to go ahead and fit your width here. Let me go ahead and get the cylinder out of the way because we do want to see exactly how much spacing we have between our cylinder and that front portion there. So let me go ahead and give you guys a closer look here. Might be a little hard to see, but from the cutout in the front of here to the cutout of our cylinder, I'm gonna go ahead and give myself that really quick. Yep, is looking to be putting us at one and five eighths of an inch there, guys. So for that cutout of that pin is, that is gonna be that front portion of your coupler, just to make sure it actually can sit on the front of there for ourselves. So, well guys, overall, I think this is gonna be an excellent way of deterring someone from trying to take your trailer. And as always, just keep honest people honest. So guys, hopefully this is gonna be a great little way of securing your trailer. That way you don't have any worries when you leave it unattended. Well guys, I think that's gonna do it for our look at the Amp Lock Coupler Lock for a rolled lip two inch or two and five sixteen cents ball couplers here at eTrailer.com. I'm Bobby, thank you for watching.